Sit on it. All right. Hi guys, what's up? It's Mel. Welcome back to my channel, or welcome to my channel. If you've never seen me before, then hi. My name is Melissa or Mel. I go by both because I do. And I am autistic. And over here we talk about autism and stuff. Sometimes. Sometimes I do book reviews, which I'm doing one today. Sometimes I talk about random things. Sometimes I do unboxings. I do a lot. But today, I um, mentioned that I'm autistic because I am doing a book review on this book right here. This book right here is called Different Not Less. It is by Chloe Hayden. If you have not heard of her, um, then she is an autistic YouTuber slash um, influencer slash autistic advocate. <laughs> and she is phenomenal. Um, and I got this book because she wrote it and I was like, you know what? I have to read this. I have to see what it's about. I have to see what it's like. But I got it also because it says a neurodivergence guide to embracing your true self and finding your happily ever after, which I think is just, it is mwah. like this book is phenomenal. It talks mainly about autism and ADHD, um, and POTS a little bit too, um, because that's what she has been diagnosed with. Um, it does not go into like Tourette's or, um, other disorders like that. I'm pretty sure Tourette's is a disorder, right? Anyway, it doesn't go into Tourette's, but it doesn't mention it. Um, it mentions the neurodivergence, and it's really, it's honestly amazing. <laughs> um, I really love this book, and I would absolutely recommend this book to everybody on the planet. Bearing in mind, it deals with women and girls, and things that happen with women and girls. Um, so yeah, <laughs> if you don't want to learn about girl things uh, and then skip the chapter that talks about that or skip the little bits and pieces that talk about it um something that i absolutely love in this book is that she puts trigger warnings on it um the trigger warnings are meant to like just in case you don't want to read about something you can skip past it and she puts it above every section every single section she labels very significantly perfectly like she labels them absolutely beautifully and it is phenomenal um <laughs> Yeah, it's phenomenal. There are a couple things that I absolutely love about this book. Um, one being that it talks a lot about Disney and fairy tales. One being that it talks a lot about Disney and fairy tales and like finding your happily ever after, which is based on the title of the book. Um, another is that it actually goes over a lot of the DSM-5, like the stuff that's in it and the diagnostic criteria for autism, for ADHD. But it also goes over other things that professionals um, have said, and people that work with autism and ADHD and, you know, like, just professionals, um, with autism and ADHD, it goes over, like, the diagnostic criteria that they've noticed that isn't in the DSM-5 yet, but stuff that is most likely to happen with somebody who is autistic and ADHD, both, or, either or. So that is something that I absolutely love about this book. <laughs> um... I love that this book uses the languages that I've been advocating about. Honestly, though, I got most of my advocacy information from Chloe Hayden from Paige Lael. Um, Paige Lael, if you don't know, is a um, Canadian autistic YouTuber and influencer, and she's amazing as well. But this book is just, I am going to have my parents read it, I'm going to have my friends read it, I'm going to have everybody read it, because I think that it is truly one of the best books out there for understanding autism and ADHD. I really do. And it has a lot of really cool references in it. It has a lot of amazing things in it like that. It has trigger warnings. Um, it's just, it's, it's incredible. And I truly, truly love this book. So I'm not going to read you any of the inserts in the book, excerpts in the book. I'm not going to read anything from inside the book because I want you guys to go out and get it on your own. And I want you guys to experience it on your own. Um, but it's, I... I could not recommend this book enough. Um, I really couldn't. This book is beyond phenomenal. It's an 11 out of 10 for me. So, um, something else that I love that it talks about in this book, not only does it talk about the criteria, but it also talks about what certain things look like, like what an autistic meltdown versus shutdown looks like, or a burnout. I experience burnout all the time. I have never experienced an autistic meltdown that I know of, or shutdown, a uh, meltdown, or whatever. I don't remember what I just said, but I have experienced burnout, and I experience it all the time. Um, it talks about disassociation a little bit, and I do disassociate quite a bit. You know, it talks about all these things. It is just, it's like, it's a guide 
to understanding autism and ADHD and possible other neurodivergencies. Um, but then it also talks about like family and caregivers and everybody else. Like what can you do to better help and support the person that you're looking after or the person that you're like a parent of or you know XYZ. And it goes over a lot of different and really good things too. So um, yeah, if you have not read this book, highly recommend it. It is beyond incredible. Um, oh, and in the very back of the book, it also has like, come on. It has support resources. So if you're general mental health resources, um, and it has the, those resources for several continents, you know, a lot of the bigger continents it has those resources for, which I think is beyond incredible because it gives you numbers, it gives you what they do, it gives you who they are, it gives you everything about them. So you have those resources at your fingertips as well. So yeah, I just wanted to give a huge shout out to Chloe Hayden because she is beyond phenomenal. I wanted to, um rate this book on 11 out of 10 honestly I wanted to give a really some really good feedback about this book because it is, it is just it is beyond incredible like I learned more about myself when I was reading and I was like oh yeah that's that's why I do that you know the thing is about me is I mask a lot so it was really hard for me and it still is really hard for me sometimes to not have imposter syndrome and think oh I or you know just like thinking that I'm not really autistic because I mask so much but reading this I'm like I'm autistic and it just it was really really nice to have that extra feeling of like I'm autistic and here's why and I know it and it's it's so it's so great so yes thank you to Chloe Hayden for writing this book and it's just it's so it's just so informative and so good so I just wanted to make a video about it that I love it and thank you guys so much for watching please subscribe I'm still trying to get to 100 subscribers so that I can get a custom YouTube URL and continue my autism advocacy and sharing my knowledge that I have and new knowledge that I gain um and yeah I love you guys very very much and I will see you guys in the next video